This is for 12 reps and the first exercise. Now this is the second exercise. Really simple bicep curl. You can do it like this for, I do it for 8 to 12 reps. Suppose if you don't, if you don't have any dumbbell, you can use a brick. You know what a brick is, right? A brick, just single-handed or both-handed you can do instead of dumbbell. If you are a beginner, brick will work. Um, Bicep workout, pull workout, which includes bicep and back. Now I'm going to hit the pull ups, which will target the back as well as the bicep a little bit. So we'll do a total of um, six exercises for three reps, uh, for three sets. Okay. This one is for the back. Dumbbell rows. I do this for 12 to 14 reps because this dumbbell is light for me. Oh, I lost the count. I hope this video is recording. Oh yeah, it's recording. So after that, another bicep exercise. I do this because it also targets my forearm. This forearm. I do this for 10 to 14 sets because it really depends on you. Uh, I, I'm using the same dumbbell throughout the workout, so 10 to 14 works for me. You see what works for you and do it for 3 sets. Yeah, challenge yourself, bro. The last bicep exercise is this. So here you're not just curling like this, but you're flaring, you're opening out your arms like outwards and you're curling up. This all is stuff. So that was the fifth exercise. Now the last one I do pull-ups. Actually I start off with pull-ups. I've done one set of pull-ups before I recorded this video. So after all this after all this one set I do for another two sets but I you know decrease the reps for if I was doing ten curls I'll do like nine eight you know what I'm saying right? This depends on you, bro, and you see what works for you.
done with the workout. Your turn. I've made a video on neck workout too, so if you want to check it out, you can check it out. Do the hard work, especially when you don't feel like it.